Have a good day. Yeah, so a while back, I decided I might become a world famous actor. So I thought, well, if I'm doing that, I might as well get knighted by the Queen while I'm at it, of course. So in order to make that happen, I would have to become a butler and follow in the footsteps of Sir John Gielgud, who battled for Arthur, and of course Sir Michael Caine, who battled for Batman. So I checked the wand ads, and it turned out that Aquaman was looking for a butler as well. So I thought, how fortuitous. Because me and Michael Caine have been mates for years. And yet, even today, if you ask Mickey, he'd say, I don't know the Muppet. <laughs> oh, Mickey, always in for a laugh. And as luck would have it, I was already in America staying at George Clooney's house. Yes. The timing couldn't have been better, of course. Apparently George was coming back and <laughs> George definitely didn't know this puppet. <laughs> so I put on my best goth outfit and went to Gotham City. And then caught a bus to the Batcave and went inside the hush hush sh sh secret entrance. And uh, really, let me set the scene for you. Now, Batman's suit, apart from being the greatest goth suit ever, it is really just the, uh, an amazing onesie with a cape. And Michael Caine, apart from being an amazing actor, a fantastic butler, turns out he's a shitty cook. And he made Batman this crappy, crappy curry that was heading straight to the bat sphincter. And then there was Batman desperately trying to get out of his onesie to do a twosie. And there was, there was Bob coming outside the toilet, holding the cape away, going, really sad. I don't believe this is in my job description. Meanwhile, there's a commissioner up on a skyscraper, you know, giving the old bat signal one of these, going, where the hell's this effing bat? And I thought, oh, it's too much. So I said to Mickey, I said, Mickey, I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll write the recommendation out for you and sign you at the Guana Maker's name. And Mickey, even in a crisis, he turns around and goes, who the hell are you? <laughs> Good one, Mickey. <laughs> Who am I? So anyway, I read the recommendation and I got the job and became Aquaman's butler, but that's a story for another time. So until then, everyone have a swear day and I'll see you at the bar. Thank you.